In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to connect a USB microphone to your Chromebook. If you often use your Chromebook for video calls or audio recording in any way, connecting a USB microphone can be a great way to noticeably improve the audio quality compared to the built-in microphone on your Chromebook. And in this video, Timmy's going to show you how you can get it all set up and connected. To get started, you'll need your Chromebook, obviously, and a USB microphone. It doesn't matter too much which USB microphone you have. Almost all of them will work with Chromebooks just fine. But some microphones might require additional software drivers, and you won't be able to install those software drivers on a Chromebook. So, if you haven't bought your microphone yet, you might want to choose one that specifically says no drivers to install, just so that you know it will definitely work on your Chromebook. Sometimes microphones that don't require drivers still don't specifically say it, so you're probably fine to just buy any microphone, but if it specifically says it has no drivers to install, you know you'll be all good to go. Now, once you've got your USB microphone, you'll need to plug it into your Chromebook. Your microphone will most likely have a USB-A cable that looks like this, and you'll need to plug the USB-A cable into a USB-A port that looks like this. A lot of Chromebooks will have a USB-A port, so you can just go ahead and plug them in, but some will only have USB-C ports. So, if your Chromebook only has a USB-C port, you need to get a USB-C to USB-A adapter like this, so that you can plug the adapter into the Chromebook and then plug the microphone into the adapter. And now, your microphone will be physically connected to your Chromebook. But you're not quite finished yet. There are still a few things you'll want to look at on the Chromebook. On the Chromebook, you'll need to click on the time in the bottom right-hand corner down here, so the time or the Wi-Fi icon, anything in this bottom corner here, to pull up this menu here. And now, on here, you'll see the volume slider here. So this is the audio output volume. So if you turn that down, it'll go down. If you turn it up, it'll go up with the volume keys on the keyboard. And you'll need to click on this little arrow that's next to the volume slider here. So we'll click on that there. And now, we're in the audio settings. So up the top here, we can see output. So you can choose if you want the output, so the stuff you hear to come out of the Chromebook speaker or headphones or external speakers or anything else you might have connected. And then down here, we also have the input settings. So this is where you can choose what microphone you want your Chromebook to use. So. We can see here we have the front microphone, so that's the microphone that's built into the Chromebook. But then below it, we also have Blue Snowball, and that is this microphone here. So if your microphone is not a Blue Snowball, it'll obviously say a different name here, but it should be pretty easy to identify which microphone it is based on what it says here. And now that you've found your USB microphone, you need to make sure it's selected so that your Chromebook will use it. So we can see here the blue snowball currently has a tick next to it and it's green rather than being grayed out. And that means the Chromebook is already using it. So when we plugged the microphone into the Chromebook before, it automatically started using it. But sometimes it won't automatically start using it. So you might come into this menu and find the front microphone is selected here with the tick next to it, and your USB microphone is grayed out. And if that happens, you'll just need to click on your USB microphone to make it start using your USB microphone. So it will usually do that automatically for you, but it's always good just to come in here and check every time you connect the microphone so that you know you're always using the correct microphone. And now, once you've selected the correct microphone, this will be your Chromebook's default microphone. And whenever you do anything on your Chromebook that requires the microphone, it normally just uses the default microphone. So now, 
pretty much anything you do on your Chromebook with a microphone, it should just start using the USB microphone. So you probably don't want it facing away from you like that. That'd give you pretty bad audio quality. You wanna have the front turned to you and ideally as close to your mouth as you can get it without it being too in the way. So maybe we'll put it there or something. That way your the words from your mouth have a clear path and they can easily get into the microphone, but that's pretty good. So we'll leave it there. And now you're ready to go. So you can click out of this menu here and pull up any audio app you want, anything that you'd be using the microphone and just start using your microphone. But sometimes some apps and websites will let you choose a specific microphone within that app. So if you've done that in the past and you've specifically chosen to use your Chromebook's built-in microphone, there's a chance you might have to find a button somewhere in that app or website to manually set it to use the USB microphone if you had already set it to use the built-in microphone because that way it's not necessarily using the default microphone, it's just specifically using the built-in microphone, so now you have to specifically make it use this microphone. But if you've never changed the microphone settings before on that app or website, it will almost definitely just be using the default microphone, which will currently be the USB microphone. And once you've chosen the correct microphone, you can also adjust the volume of the microphone with a slider back in the quick settings menu. The default volume is usually pretty good, so Tim would probably recommend you just leave it as it is and test it out first. But if it's too loud or too quiet, all you need to do is come back and click on the time down here and click on the arrow next to the volume slider again. And then when you come down to the USB microphone here, you can click and drag this slider to make it louder or quieter. So if we click and drag to the right, we could turn it all the way up and now it will record really loudly or we could click and drag right down and make it really quiet. But Timmy's actually going to turn it up quite high because Timmy knows this microphone is often a bit quiet. So Timmy will put it up really high, but that's really up to you. You can test it a bit with your microphone and your voice and try and get it to the right sound. But now the microphone is set up and connected and everything's configured. So you're ready to just start using your microphone for whatever you want. And then when you're finished with the microphone and you want to disconnect it, all you really need to do is physically unplug the microphone from your Chromebook. So we'll move that out of the way and pull the plug like that. And now you're pretty much done. That's all you really need to do. Now the default microphone will automatically switch back to the built-in microphone. So whenever an app or website tries to use the default microphone, it will just go back to using the built-in microphone. If you did manually set a certain app or website to specifically use the USB microphone, you might have to manually change it back to the built-in microphone if you ever want to use the built-in microphone. But as Timmy mentioned before, it's pretty unlikely you would need to do any of that at all. And that's all there is to it. That's how you can connect a USB microphone with your Chromebook. So hopefully you found this video helpful and Tamil see you in the next one.